Hey guys, Ghost here, and today we're playing the Copper Port Case Files under the stairs. I had to record this so many times because I did not say that dang R and port. Uh, no clue what this is about. Uh, I think you're a detective and you're on a case. That's about it. So let's just jump into it. I like how... I just like that. I don't know why, but I do. <laughs> okay, let's... What are the controls? Inventory is I, journal J, camera mode, pause, blah, blah. Okay, okay let's, let's, let's get it. That was scary. Where else? Here we. Hubris Digital Passage. Do, do. Professor, Professor Stitch game. Based on the characters and location created by. Okay. 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 Peacock pie? Is that what? What's bright? The Copper Port case files. Under the case file number eight four seven under the stairs. What you want, baby? What you want? Dargo says hi. You can see his little booper snoot. What? Go lay down. Go lay down. Call to the Missingham Valley Dispatch. Massingham Valley Dispatch. How can I help? Uh, yeah, hi. Is this the policeman on emergency line? <laughs> yes, we dispatch for them. Can I help you? I'd like to request a well-being check on a neighbour. Uh, it's probably nothing, but he's kind of frail and I just haven't seen him around for a few days. Okay, can I take the gentleman's name, please? Peter Renton. He's at 12 Rock Ferry Lane. An officer's on the way. Can I take your name? The officer is me. Also, is this in England? That was a very England ac accent. 18th April 2019, uh, 9.37pm. <laughs> Following a call to the Copperport Police Department, Constable Henry Crane arrives at the Renton property. Was it done with that? Oh, great. Dispatch. I'm on scene at the Renton property. Acknowledge. Report back when he's located into Renton. Acknowledge, dispatch. Stand by. Okay. What's in my inventory? Nothing. What's in my journal? Nothing. Okay. Okay. Guess we should knock on the door for it first, right? Press enter. Mr. Renton, Police Constable Crane, can you open the door, please? Turn that on. There's no answer. Mr. Renton! Break the glass. There's no answer. Well, we're breaking in. I don't like how you have to press enter. It's locked on the other side. The furniture is absolutely soaked with the rainwater. The puddles pulled e on e <coughs> Excuse me. The puddles pulled on each seat have turned brown from the rusty metal. Red, a heavy red engineering brick has come loose from the barbecue. <laughs> Right. Okay. Weird. The controls are weird. Let that be known. Crates full of soil, fertilizer, and other gardening supplies. Yeah. 
The door is locked. The glass is cracked. Maybe I can use that. Oh. I'm sorry? I didn't actually want to do that yet. You reach in and unlock it. Oh, gas oven. Nothing too much interesting. It looks like it has, hasn't been used in a while. A butcher's receipt. The paper is marked with dried blood. Okay, new evidence. Ugh, by the smell of the fridge door has been left open for a few days now. Books of piano sheet music. I was more of a triangle man myself. Oh, you're funny. The painting of what looks like some winged bloke in a bird bath. I'm usually for a dining room to save the least. A crumpled letter addressed to Mr. Renton. Letter addressed to Mr. Renton from the London-based publishing house. The letter offers vague condolences and understanding that for Renton's personal tragedies, before abruptly changing tone to remind him that he's now four months overdue for his latest remaining scripture. <clears throat> Re for a receipt from a local butcher shop dated six days ago for the delivery of one live pig. The crumpled letter, uh, crumpled, crumpled paper is stained with what appears to be dried blood. Okay. A framed degree in the field of anthropology. The table has been overturned and knocking the lamp onto the floor. I'll not fix it. The door is locked. Oh, it's a clock. Okay. Missing flyer has been posted through the door. A missing post of a young boy named Toby Masters. Toby was last seen the 5th April 2019 in the area of Rocket Ferry Lane. He was wearing a navy blue jacket, cargo shirts, and a red and white cap with the spider logo on the front. Oh. Lock and bolt it. Watch from the inside. Confirm the latch with something narrow. So, crowbar? Nothing of interest. Oh, door opened. <clears throat> Your driver? Narrow blunt item. Oh, it's a letter opener. Tickets? A pair of old plane tickets under Peter and Trisha Renton's name. Uh, corkboard covered with research, notes, and a map of Serbia. Okay. Okay. Okay, Mr. Renton. It's the popo. Doing. Travel insurance claim form detailing medical care was in Siberia. Okay. The collection of books authored by Mr. Oh, okay, Mr. Renton is a writer. The bed is neatly made. Doesn't look like it has been slept in recently. this. There we go. Uh, okay. Uh, sir? So? Sir? Uh, sir? You okay? You sleeping? A shiny brass key for a cylinder lock. Is Train to dispatch. I'm gonna need paramedics to roll for a line. Confirmed, constable. Have you located Mr. Wendt? Yeah, looks like a heart attack. Rocky's been dead a few days now. 
Let's leave that to the medical examiner to decide, Constable. An ambulance has been dispatched. ETA, 20 minutes. Secure the premises and sit tight. 20 minutes? Uh-oh. My game freeze? Oh no, there it goes. Photo pills. That was weird. How'd the game do that? The sink is pretty unremarkable. Some small brownish red stains fleck fleck the plug hole. Sorry, plug hole. Fuck me up for a second. Well, I don't know what I would expect to find. I don't know either. Cross to Peter Wren. Here's he's been dead for a few days. Wee. Excuse me? Oh, never mind back here. Uh, that's why I cannot see shit. So what was locked? The shed outside, right? Inventory. Use. The door is locked. Use. A flat brass key. The metal is bright and untarnished, suggesting the key has been recently cut. Looks like it would fit a simple cylinder light, typically used on internal doors. Oh, this one? The box from the other side. Um, there's the pig. What door was locked? Ironically, my granddad had a clock like this. The gentle swing of the pendulum is almost hypnotic. See, all these doors were open. Is it for this? Oh, what is the press key? Oh, is it the basement? The basement. Ignore that. <laughs> I call him off. Oh. Oh. What that say? Bloody handprint. A bloody handprint stains the wall of the cellar steps. Has dried and appears to be a few days old. The position suggests it was most likely made by someone steadying the themselves while climbing the stairs. That doesn't seem good. Wink. A bunch of random random boxes and junk have been dumped here. Nothing useful. Hand a remote. Keep up. A local news people dated eight, eight days ago. An old newspaper. Oh. The newspaper, thank you. An old newspaper from the last week. The front page is dominated by the story of a missing 10 year old, Toby Masters, alongside is a story about the break in the vandalism of a Jubilee Green crematorium a few miles down the road back. Down the road. Let's just do the lock with the padlock. So. Key. Oh, shit. I cannot see. Key in the garage, because the fob is the garage door opener, right? Let's go. Examine. <laughs> Battery powered remote transmitter has nothing, it's just a single button mounted on it. Which suggests that it performs a simple test as to turning on something on and off, or locking and unlocking something. Let me turn my phone off. Go left the garage, right? At the at the garage, right?
here. But now I'm just confused. Do I watch on the other side? Oh, my bad. The door opens remotely. I have the remote though. I thought that would work. I was wondering, they're learning the piano. Shame my hands are like shovels. That's a weird statement, sir. Right? has been left on. I can almost make out the shapes moving in the static. Oh, that's not a weird statement. Excuse me? My heart hurts. the shit on me. The urn is empty. Where the fuck did it come from? What oh, did it fall? the no way we use this key fob bit. Uh, Mr. Renton! A rusty steel modus key. Uh, Mr. Renton's gone. As the urn from the hallway shrine has fallen and smashed on the hardwood floor. Upon closer inspection, it appears to have been empty and shows no sign of ever being held, ever having held cremated remains. No mortis key. The, ste the steel is tarnished with rust and scratches from years of use. It should fit a lever lock. It's combined with the rust and plies it fits an exterior door. Okay. Mr. Renton, don't fuck with me. This door? You unlocked it. Okay. Mr. Renton, don't fuck with me. I'm scared. Long wooden pole hooked with an iron hook at one end. Okay. For a butt coder, the rusted clothes and useless. Is that a flashlight? Three amp copper fuse. Okay. Got a meat hook. These works not on the garage walls. Covering. Do I need to use this? Oh, I need a screwdriver. Do I use this? Oh, are you stop! Oh God, I didn't expect this game to be like this. Oh, cleaver is lodged firmly in the tabletop. I'm sure it wasn't there before. Oh, Mr. Renton! Excuse you! Sir? What the hell? It's Renton's body. Someone has to be screwing with me. Oh, this is getting right spooky. have lock on it. Oh, right. Come on. Ifa. Damn. It's 
So. I need. I cannot see. Hold on. I got confused. I have something to pull something. I don't remember anything needing to be pulled that I remember. I almost broke my legs. from the other side. Two meter wooden pole with a hefty hook on fit into one side. Commonly used for those hard to reach places such as tall windows and attic hatches. Oh, is there an attic hatch? I didn't even look for an attic. This is why you examine everything. Mr. Renton, do you have an attic? Oh, you do! Ouch! Oh, ouch! It bought me my big ass head. Hello? 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 Anybody there? An incomplete manuscript for the Professor Renton's latest book. Yeah, hey, screwdriver. Screwdriver is lodged in the floorboards. Thank you. I'm rightfully fucking scared for when I run back. Ooh, I knew it. I knew it. I knew it. Mr. Anton's gone! Mr. Anton's gone! Oh no! Mr. Anton! Anton... I'm just... Uh, you needed a poop? That's what I'm gonna say. You just needed a poop. Now I can open the garage door. Mr. Anton. Mr. Ren's car. The tires and wheel arches are spotted with dried mud. A slaughtered pig. Its blood is collected in the bucket below. Drums full of surplus gasoline. I guess Renton's the kind of man who likes to be prepared. Okay, or if there's a body in it. A can of motor oil. Why do I need that? Motor can oil. A motor oil can found in the Renton garage. It can, the can is almost empty, but there's an, just enough at the bottom for maybe a single application. What? What did I need oil for? What did I need? Oil for. Where did Mr. Renton go? You laying down? Oh. Well, said I could do something with. Him. Oh, it's that. I don't need that. You ready for that? Oh fuck, what needed oil? Try 
Her book is rusted clothes and useless. Is this what we needed it for? Big brain. Big brain power. It will work perfectly, so now I can cut the bottom lock, right? Okay. Cause that's the most logical place to go. Gonna open your basement door and hopefully not find a little boy. Uh, Mr. Ring? I'm not CPS, this ain't not my problem. <laughs> Is that the little boy? The little boy? Walls have been covered with crucifixes. Oh, it's the little boy! Red and white baseball cap has been abandoned in the corner of the room. A dirty old mattress and blanket and looks whatever I saw in the living room down here. Oh no. Oh no, Mr. Ritten! At 10.09 p.m. on the 18th of April 2019, responding to Police Constable Crane's request, paramedics were dispatched to the home of the late Peter Renton. On their arrival, they found the door open and the property abandoned. To this day, the whereabouts of Peter Clive Renton and police officer Henry Crane still remains a mystery. I'm in the basement! <laughs> what do you mean a mystery? Did you even check the basement? Upset. What the hey hey? What the hey hey? That was good though. I like that. A couple of those junk scares got me. Everything got me. I want more. That's bright. I hope you get more. Is that it? Well, if that's it, then. Ooh. I'm waiting for something to happen. <laughs> I missed one piece of evidence. One. Whack. Whack. <sighs> anyway. <laughs> Give me a like. If you feel up to it. Subscribe if you want more. And check the links down below. If you want to play this for yourself and go find that one last piece this way one last piece of evidence and if you do comment down below tell me what it was i'm excited to know other than that y'all have a great day <laughs>